are you doing there? I wouldn't know anybody's out there in the world because I'm on lockdown. Yeah, in my living room. It's terrible. And uh, by the way, this is what smart people look like, or rich people when they cut their cigars. You know, got their smart people glasses on. So let me tell you a bit about what's going on around here. Um, can't go to the store because I'm on freaking lockdown. So this is now my cigar lighter. How do you like that? I burnt my freaking eyebrows with the damn thing already. It's, it's terrible. I mean, the cat. You ought to see the cat. The cat looks terrible. It's half hairless. Uh, kind of a new breed. I mean, half hairless, hairless cat with with the cigar lighter. So anyway, uh, my ear itches. Oh, and whatever you do, don't touch your face. You got it? Don't touch your face. All right. Let's light this bad boy. Now listen, there's been some bad things going on with this COVID. <laughs> He's lighting his cigar with a torch. <laughs> Alright, didn't burn nothing down there. Still got both my eyebrows. The COVID. Listen. Y'all know. I got a list. This long. From my wife. We got to get the hell out of COVID. We got to get out of COVID-19 lockdown. I can't do this anymore. Do you know how much stuff's gotten fixed around my house? The water faucet don't leak no more. Air conditioning filter got changed. Hell, I ain't changed that in three years. Now what's going to happen? It's going to run better. And she's going to think, oh, he can fix anything. He's a genius. So see what I've been doing, see? I stay in my uniform a little bit longer. And what happens when I do that is I get, I have a sense of urgency at home. She thinks I'm coming back to work. My honeydew list goes from this long to like this here. See? You guys, you catching me? You feeling me? Now, Sometimes I get home, I like to do my COVID pose. This is my COVID pose. Then all of a sudden, <laughs> I can hear that yell coming from across the house. She's coming to get me. I'm always running from the wife. Oh, man. And then you got the head in the garage. It's the uniform. She thinks I'm going back to work. Little does she know. I got a stash of these babies in the garage. I got some iced tea out there. Some beer for my friends. None for the horses. No beer for the damn horses. I mean, who ever thought about that anyway? That's the dumbest damn movie I ever heard in my life. Beer for my horses. What the hell's wrong with you people? You can't give beer to a horse. Anyway. So other things that's been happening around my house. Um, you know, I know a lot of you guys out there. You do, you know, you're married, you're at home, you're long, you're locked down. Locked down. Lockdown means chase the wife. Man, I've been chasing her around this house so much, I look like a damn track star. I know you can't tell it, but I do. Underneath these clothes is a body of armor. <laughs> I'm lying, man. I've been eating the hell out of everything. But you know what's happened? I was eating everything, and I gained about 30 pounds. So she made me go on a diet. Now we're squirting shit under my tongue. I'm eating vegetables. I hate vegetables. I'm only doing it because it keeps me out of damn trouble. But I figured if I do that, maybe she'd let me do a little more catching and let her chase, instead of chasing. And chasing sucks. I'm telling you what, man. Did you know you can wear a hole in your carpet chasing her around the bedroom? Y'all see my carpet? It, it looks like the 200-yard dash in there. Just a circle around the bed like this. Circle, 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 circle. <laughs> That's all we do anymore. But the other thing about COVID is you don't realize how much stuff in your house is broke till you see with your own two eyes walking around the house. Man, the faucet was leaking. I fixed that. The refrigerator wasn't quite level. That took two days, though. I kept opening it. Uh, let's see. What else was broke? Oh, the stove was jacked up. My wife dropped a fish stick down in the stove. You know what happened to a fish stick when it's down inside the stove for three days? It looks like a dog turd come out of there. Woo! I mean, that thing was stinking. Every time, every time we'd have some cook something in the stove, it smelled like it was down fish sticks time again. And I hate fish sticks. You know how nasty fish sticks are? You try eating them. Lockdown. You're on lockdown. You can't go to the grocery store when you want to when you're on lockdown. You can't go run down to the uh, little supermarket on the corner down there and get you some bacon. Eat fish sticks, because that's all you got is fish sticks. Heck, I've been eating the kids' food, my cereal. You know, the other night it got so bad, I was in there, 
My wife called me with my head down in the dog food bowl. You know you just when you eat the dog food bowl. I was in the dog food bowl 20 minutes. That little son gun bit me three times. Whew. This COVID stuff got to end. I'm on lockdown. I hate this. Lockdown. And that ain't the only thing that's locked down. She got a lockdown too. Everything's locked down. I hate it. So, what I decided, I went outside. I said, what could be happening outside? What could be happening that would be bad during the lockdown outside? Didn't say I couldn't go outside, but I can't be going anywhere else. You gotta stay at home, see? So, do you know how boring it is going on a cruise in your truck? Down the driveway and back? Ain't a lot to see. So I told her, I said, I said, listen here, you stand down here outside and say, hey baby, and then run ahead of me and I'll drive down the driveway real slow to radio up real loud. And then I'll come by you and you say, hey sexy, I think there's two women on the street while I'm cruising that's looking at me. That's <laughs> genius. I even put her on the other side of the driveway so I thought it was something different. Now, there's another thing that happened while I was outside though. I'm walking around the yard, almost broke my freaking ankle. Man, I got moles everywhere. You know what happened then? She's like, look, while we're both outside, we played your little game cruising up and down the driveway, which ain't real far. You know, it's like reverse, stop, forward, stop, reverse, stop. That's about as far as you get, about 100 feet. I got a long driveway. So, <laughs> now, outside, the trees need pruned. Yeah, prune the trees. And then she wanted grass planted over here. Then she wanted me to fix the holes in the yard for the moles. Moles ever damn where. I feel like Caddyshack if I find that little son. Oh, wait, that was a gopher. Well, it's the same damn thing. It's a critter in the ground that burrows underneath the dirt. So I don't give a damn what they're called. I need to kill them. So I'm standing out there in the, with a shotgun. Yeah, you make a lot bigger hole with a shotgun. Than the damn moles do. I'm gonna tell you what, man, I got holes all over my yard now, but I'll tell you one thing, them moles, they know who the boss is now, because I'm on lockdown, baby. Now you know who the boss is. Now look here. I'm looking at my window now outside. When I was outside, I noticed another thing, the gutter's hanging down on the house. You got the gutter hanging down, you know it's rain season, it's gonna go, you know it's gonna come down. But I ain't gonna fix it. I ain't gonna do it. She can't make me. She can't make me fix it. I told her I'd do it next week. And then I fixed it. Yesterday. Look, you don't know what it's like to live with her. I've been on lockdown a month and a half now. I'm going nuts. I need something to do. The positive thing about lockdown was I've had one hell of a vacation. 